World Oceans Day. From the air we breathe to the water we drink, the Earth's oceans play a vital role in our everyday lives. World Oceans Day takes place every year on the 8th of June. It's a day to come together to think about the importance of our oceans and how we can protect them. The day has been celebrated for more than 30 years. And today, countries all over the world take part to raise awareness. Every living thing needs water to survive. On Earth, water can be found in rivers, lakes, even underground. But most is actually found in the oceans. Plus, if you take a deep breath, 50% of the oxygen we breathe comes from our oceans. And the oceans absorb some of the carbon dioxide in the atmosphere, which helps to reduce the causes of climate change. The oceans cover over 70% of our planet and make up 97% of all the water in the world. Whilst there is only really one big ocean, it is split up into five regions known as the Arctic, Atlantic, Indian, Pacific, and Southern Oceans. Diving deep underwater reveals a magical, biodiverse world. From the smallest life forms, including tiny plankton, to the largest creature that exists, the blue whale. 80% of the underwater world remains unexplored and scientists think there could be thousands of species living there yet to be discovered. In shallow waters, there are coral reefs that are made up of tiny creatures that are actually animals, not plants. They're also home to many other types of animals, such as colorful fish, sponges, mollusks, and crabs. The deepest waters are in the Mariana Trench in the Pacific Ocean, where the water can be up to 11 kilometers deep. Animals that live here have adapted to the cold, dark conditions. But the wonderful wildlife of the oceans is at risk. Rising water temperatures and pollution, as well as overfishing, are all threats that are changing the marine environment. Human activity, such as the burning of fossil fuels in cars, planes, and power stations, is a major contributor to global warming. This is increasing water temperatures, making it too warm for some living things to survive. Plastic is a big problem too. It can harm animals as they can become caught in it or confuse it with food, which can make them unwell and can even kill them. On World Oceans Day, there are mass beach cleanups and events to raise awareness of the issues facing our seas. Today we are um, we're looking for microplastics that have basically been left in the sea and then washed up on our beaches. Fish will eat these and then it'll end up in the food chain and fish will die from it and then we'll eat those fish and we'll get ill because we've just ingested those plastics. So what can we do to help make things better? We are part of the problem, but can also be part of the solution anything from beach cleans, considering what you actually buy when you go into supermarkets. Look for an item which has probably got less plastic on it or less packaging on it. We can avoid using plastic by swapping to alternatives, like fabric bags, metal or paper straws, and reusable water bottles. But if we do use plastic, we can make sure we recycle it whenever possible. Some people are helping by removing plastic that's already in the oceans, and turning it into everyday items. Clothes, shoes, even art displays. There are nearly eight billion people on the planet and we all rely on the oceans. So we must look after our blue planet. The ocean is beautiful, but most importantly, it keeps us alive. What will you do to protect our oceans this World Oceans Day and every other day too?